Uh, I'm not really sure, uh, but we'll, we'll take them. I mean, hopefully we we'll continue talking about home runs. We're having good at bats. That's what's encouraging. And we saw, you know, their starter has good stuff. First time through the lineup, kind of quiet. Uh, but felt like we made some adjustments, put ourselves in hitters counts, took some walks. A lot of our early runs came because we had guys on base from walks. So uh, a lot of good things there. And then obviously we sep separated and got, got some home runs. Jeffrey Springs, three hits, 15 swings and misses. Just another outstanding performance by him. Yeah, he's he's on a pretty good run right now. Uh, glad that we were able to get the, the seventh inning. I mean, he, he worked a little bit early in the ball game. I, I think it was the second inning that they had some, some traffic, but um, his stuff is just really playing well right now. You know, righty, lefty, it doesn't matter. He's got great feel for the breaking ball and, and obviously the changeup. What kind of adjustments did you see? Because like you said, Fujinari seems like was cruising through three. And yeah, really uh, I, I think early on, you know, he, he was – not necessarily in the zone, um, but we were kind of going out of the zone with him. I think the guys collectively made a, a good adjustment on making sure that once we got in hitters' counts, let's try to stay in hitters' counts with swinging at good pitches. I know Chad Matola has you know reinforced that throughout all spring. So uh, when it happens in the middle of a game, it's, it's pretty rewarding. Kevin Kelly is taking advantage of his opportunities too. You might have found something good there. Yeah, he's um, he does some unique things. I mean, he's got 23 inches of, of, of break to the slider and 21 inches of sink to the um, to his fastball. You know, that's 40 inches, 45 inches of play. Not many guys can can create that much. You see it more north south, but what he does east west is pretty special. You were up nine going into the seventh. Any thoughts on uh, taking Jeffrey Springs out before that seventh inning? Um, take, I mean, just with the workload, yeah, but, but we're playing a lot of games in a row here. We want to be able to tack on innings to our pitchers. He went six, really good his last outing. Uh, and Kyle and I talked. His pitch com number was low enough where we felt okay with it. I mean, just all around the way that you guys are playing, I mean, you see the run differential. What's impressed you the most so far to start the season? Um... I mean, our starting pitching has been pretty good. I, I don't know if I can pinpoint. When you're winning games like this, a lot of things got to be going well. So I'm, I'm, I think we're all pretty impressed with, with every facet of it. Defensively, Luke Rayley early in the game. That, ball that was a big long. play, yeah. Um, came and got the ball. A nice piece of hitting. I think it was Peterson that stayed on a pitch, but Rayley was right there. I mean, how nice is that to have a guy that can play first one day and then go out and play <laughs> left and make make throws like that? Uh, Siri went on the disabled list. What, yeah. what, did you get a grade on? Yeah, grade one, uh, right hamstring. So, uh, you know, we'll give it a couple days. We really can't tell uh, until that first week of how he's responding. But knowing him, he'll bust up treatment and rehab, and we'll try to get him back as soon as possible. He's a big, big part of what we're trying to accomplish. See Margot and Bruhan in center. Can Josh Lowe get out there? Yeah, I think uh, Manny and, and, and Josh will see uh, the reps out there. And you just want to get Wander off his feet? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> he doesn't like to come out of games. He doesn't like days off. He doesn't like the DH. So if we separate a game, I'm going to try to get him out. <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank yep. you. All right.